When is Arthur getting that cod liver oil? Maybe he's got it. Maybe he's already sent a note on the blower. I'm so close to our playground. Maybe I should just see if he's there. And see how things are going. Got it. Your precious cod liver oil. Lifesaver. Have you got my letter of transit then? Arthur, we're practically the only two people in this entire city not stoned out of our minds on joy. You look... rough. What do you care? How are you going to get out? Why won't you just give me the fucking letter of transit? Oh, it's always what you want, always what you need, every little Sally whim. Bloody cod liver oil. Am I really that awful? Well, just because you seduced my dad in my mum's bed while you were staying in our house? How was I supposed to tell him no? I would never anywhere else to go. Um, sorry. Here. Let's go together. We're two musketeers. I'm scared, Arthur. Aren't you? <sighs> it's going crazy out there. We have to go now. Wait, wait. I have to go back to my place first. Why? And we sort of have to wait till dawn. Oh, God, no. There's something I have to tell you. No, that, that, that's crazy. I, I can't. Oh, you shouldn't have asked for that ridiculous cod liver oil. I've got a baby. <sighs> it's just self-preservation, Sally. No hard feelings. Arthur? Arthur? Did he even hear me? Of course he heard you. He just didn't care. At least he brought the cod liver oil. At least that. I've got to get it to Gwen as fast as I can. is perfectly horrid. I know. But it will help you fight those nasty measles. And that is everything. We're gonna see the world, darling. We're gonna leave this awful place and go wherever we want. Just as soon as you're feeling better. All right, I know a thing or two about the General's boat. Now I just need a boat motor. I hope Dr. Faraday can make me one I can carry. You're tired, aren't you? Mummy's so tired you could cry too. Did you know that? Why don't you close your lovely eyes? The girl needs her beauty sleep. Wouldn't you like to have some lovely dreams? Mummy could really use some lovely dreams. I really could. Oh. 
Oh dear. Oh, shut it up. I hope she's not gone on holiday. Annie's pretty neat, isn't she? Oh, this again. It was months ago. I was only dancing. Well, she turned you someone's on. Someone's inside, obviously. I was only dancing. You wanted her. Don't get me wrong. I was only dancing. I Come was on. watching from the stairs. I know stairs. you're in there, James. James. Roger, it's Sally you Boyle. Are everyone. Oh, Sally. What are you doing here, Roger? Roger, it's Sally Boyle. Where's Doctor Faraday? Is she all right? I'm afraid she died. There was an explosion. For fuck's sake, James. It's Sally Boyle. She, she's not here. She, she died. James. She said she died in the explosion. Oh, fuck. She's right upstairs. Roger! Oh, it's been too long. Did you hear about Constable Rossetti's wife's cake? Just about as fast, too. They locked up Dr. Faraday. Why? Dr. Faraday? It's Sally Boyle. Dr. Faraday? James said you're alive. I suppose three can keep a secret as sure them are dead. You're hiding in your own house. I don't believe people. They want things. Disturbs my thought processes. That's a shame. I rather like people. I used to have the most beautiful collection of records. Help me tune everyone out. But all my records blew up with my house. What brings you here? Who do you listen to? I'm sort of embarrassed to admit it, but... The make-believes. The early stuff, before Nick sold out. The unicorn song? That's my favourite. I had a rather brilliant formula in my head the last time I had it on. See, I've been trying to make a sort of portal. No matter. I lost the idea when I lost the record. I know where a copy is. I think I could get it for you. Really? I know if I heard that song, I'd remember my idea. That's how my brain works. Could you make me a motor for a Bristol pilot? Boat motor? I thought sneeze is more complicated than a boat motor. I thought you were here for something difficult. Ah, sure. You bring me the unicorn song and I'll make you a boat motor. The unicorn song? 
That awful song. I bet the only person in Wellington Wells who hasn't burned their record is Nick himself. I can't believe how many times he made me listen to it. Well, at least we were on drugs. He'd never part with it. On the other hand, he's passed out half the time I come by. I'll just sneak in while he's sleeping. Where did I leave the key card he gave me? It's in that suitcase I brought to the Bobbies. Where the hell did I leave it there? Now I remember, they wanted to carry me around in that car like I was some sort of conquering hero. I just wanted to get down on the ground, clean forgot there was anything in that goddamn suit. It's your fault for leading me on. I'll keep you on if you can't be friendlier. And here's Nick's key card. Why do they make dresses with pockets, for Christ's sakes? Well, funky as ever. I'm not surprised the maid quit.
It's probably down in his secret lair. How do we get down there? He had some sort of secret button, didn't he? Well, this is a clever hint. A bit paranoid, aren't we? What's he been taking? someone actually likes this record aside from Nick of course either I've got the bloody weight of the world on my shoulders or I need to drop a few things I'm carrying
stuck in a bucket. Whoa, look, lads. It's our lucky day. We don't need to go through this again, do we? Don't you remember what happened last time? I have a very poor memory. Almost as bad as my impulse control. Fact remains, you have been selling unapproved pharmaceuticals in Bobby Catesby's domain. And you ain't paid for that privilege. All right. Let's dance. Do you have my record? I have indeed. This is fantastic! I'm finally going to be able to make my portal. Uh, never mind about it. And my motor? Have you made that? And you have earned your boat motor. I won't ask you whose boat or where you're sailing it. I have an entirely different plan. Does it involve portals? Clever lass! Hmm. Remarkably compact for a boat motor. All right. I've got a boat motor and a boat manual. Now all I need is the General's bloody key. He doesn't have it in his office in the camp, or I'd have found it already. If I know him at all, it's in his safe house. <laughs> 